modifying a camera mount, some new items in the mail, and a request. Ah, oh, good evening YouTube. It is 9.32 in the evening. Uh, I'm here at the uh, bench again. I did get the, uh, the little um, adapter made for my uh, uh, cell phone holder and it does work rather well. I have a couple screws in the bottom of it and that's held in it rather well. As you can see I use the uh, saw blades to cut these off. Uh, not the best job in the world but it, or it works. That's always really cared about and it's really secure in there. I mean it's not gonna fall out so that's for sure. Uh, really not a lot of uh, you know, need for uh, you know a lot of stuff anyway the uh, so when this is let's see it'll be this way yeah or it'll be this way well whatever but I mean actually I need the uh, that on the other side but that's okay uh, I can get that fixed up pretty sure like this So there you go. There's your. Uh, there's what it'll look like when it's sitting. Yeah, down like that. And I'll see. I've still got it wrong. <laughs> I had it right the first time. It needs to be this way. So anyway, we'll get it right. We're we're not worried about it. Uh, I, I it kind of depends on what I use for uh, uh, if I use a, uh, you know, this here. A little tripod or if I use the uh, camera boom because you know it's gonna be because if it's up this way actually it would probably work that way I mean I'm gonna draw back here in a little bit and show you what I'm talking about Right, here you can see what it's going to look like. I'll put it over here by the uh, the ding dong. So that would, yeah, that would fit nicely. I don't know what it's going to look at though. Let's see what it does see. I don't think it's up high enough to tell you the truth or close enough or too far closer, I guess is what I'm saying. Well, see, now that sees. That will see the uh, scope, and that's about it. I need it right there. It's where I need it for all three. So I'll have to figure out how to do that. Of course, the camera boom would work fine for that, and I guess I could use the uh, tripod then for the other camera. I don't really like to do that, though. I like to be able to use the ki the the camera boom on the on the ones that need to be moved around like that. See, that's kind of what I like. So anyway, we'll have to think about it, but at least it does work. And it's, uh, like I said, it's not the end of the world that it doesn't reach the... Uh, I don't know if I could do it this way. Yeah, that pretty much gets you all three. Get to a piece of wood there. Let's just see what this does. Hmm. Not doing a lot. Not quite enough. But it's a it's a start, like I say. I could probably put that up a little bit like that. There you go. Alright, now there you go. That's all three of them. And it's it's not straight on, but I mean I could move it over a little bit if I needed to. So that would work in a pinch. Probably can't do much. Yeah, it seems to be pretty steady. So, you guys even seeing that? No, you wasn't, was you? I'm sitting there looking at it, and I'm saying, yeah, it, worked, it looks straight. <laughs> There's what it looks like. 
So you can see uh, the fluke is up the top, there's the heat kit, and there's the uh, scope. So yeah, all three of them are in there. And that would work. So, Alright, at least we know we can do that if we need to. So that is uh, excellent. Indeed. Alright, I'm going to cut this off now. I've got to go to V-Bay tomorrow. Um, I won't go into all, all the gory t details, but suffice to say, Mom is uh, <laughs> Mom is causing problems at the nursing home. Uh, for one thing, she goes into people's rooms at night and turns their television off. Uh, <laughs> well, you know, it's just silly stuff like that, but uh, she, she has a... Uh, yeah, you know, thing about stuff like that, I guess that she you know, people need to go to bed and do work, going to go according to her schedule. I guess is what she's. She hasn't been sleeping at night at all, so uh, we're gonna. The uh, nursing home uh, is getting kind of tired of it, is, uh, and it's not just that. There's other things. She's been, uh, I guess, picking fights with the the other residents and things like that. <laughs> you know, you it's hard to think of your 92 year old mother doing that, but you know, whatever. Whatever. So anyway, I'm, I'm supposed to meet my sister tomorrow down there, and I uh, guess we'll decide then what to do. But uh, anyway, that'll that'll turn out good, I'm sure. <laughs> well, good afternoon, YouTube. Here with you at, uh, or I should say, back with you. <laughs> uh, I uh, I had to go to uh, Vivi. I think as many of you uh, know. Um, I did get that done. I think you can see that. And that's mounted in there, and it's that thing will be really good, I think. But uh, uh, That's not what this video is about, or this part of the video. I know I did uh, one part already. Um, I got these in the mail today. Now, I know these are not probably the answer to our problem, but uh, as I uh, searched for the answer, I thought, well, we'll try these. These were, I think, $7.95 shipped, which, uh, you know, and they do come apart. They have the, uh, I think you can see there, there's a screw hole in there. I haven't actually taken them apart yet. Now, these are USB speakers, but, you know, that can be removed. That's not a big deal. Uh, I'm sure we could make these work. I mean, after all, Bob's got that uh, uh, one that he made, a real small one, so... And I'm sure these could be made to work as well, but uh, I'm not crazy about the speaker. You know, the, I think they pasted in a uh, just a piece in there. Now it's got a r rubber surround around it, but I, I don't care for that little little part there. I mean, I guess it protects the speaker all right, but uh, just not crazy about it. Anyway, um, the. Uh, thing I did like I said I wanted to show you that I did get that and also a request uh, I've got a uh, little uh, great nephew uh, I guess that's what you call calling my my great niece's do uh, son <laughs> anyway uh, he's just starting on YouTube and uh, I want to I want to you know have some of you guys if you will just check out his video I'll put a link to his channel uh, in the description below and uh, just you know stop by give him some words of encouragement now I, he's he's just a little tyke I think he's nine years old I'm pretty sure and uh, like I said that's uh he's got a phone and that's what he's using I've, I've already for you Bill I know Bill's gonna say well don't use the phone this way use it this way well yeah I know he's he's give him a break okay <laughs> I did tell him that uh, he needs to do it that way so it'll fill the screen. But uh, anywho, that's uh, like I say, I'll give you a link to his. I think his latest video, and he may have made one since then. He's <laughs> he's pretty uh, pretty gung ho on the YouTube. So uh, like I said, he uh, he he needs some help, and uh, appreciate anybody that stops over and checks it out and uh, gives him some words of encouragement. Like I said, you know, everybody started out somewhere. Um, I think it impressed him that I had over 700 subscribers, and then I tried to tell him that that's not very much. Uh, but, uh, you know, obviously it's more than none, or more than, I think he had 18. 
but uh, like I said, and that's probably just friends and family. But like I say, give him some love and, and uh, let him know that, uh, you know, everybody had to start you know, that way, you know, on YouTube. That's just the way things are. And uh, anywho, uh, encourage him. And he's uh, he's just using his phone right now, but uh, I think uh, he's going to be getting uh, online uh, with a computer. And I've, I've turned him on to Windows Movie Maker and told him that, uh, you know, it would be a good editor to start with. He, he really wants to be able to edit his videos and things like that, so. Alright, that's going to do it. I'll uh, combine this with the first part about the the uh, camera mount and uh, get this up there and you guys can check it out. Now, I still haven't done anything with the uh, other, uh, other radio. <laughs> I had a thought last night. You know I do that often. Um, <laughs> you guys probably know what I'm talking about, but... Um, when you get something new with a, a clear screen like that, there's usually a protective layer on top of that. Use a little thin clear plastic. I'm thinking, wonder if it's possible if they put a tinted um, screen over the top of that. Uh, you know, that clear plastic protection. And I've never, never took anything off of it, so I'm going to check that out. There's a good possibility that that may be the whole reason I can't see that thing during the day. So I'm going to do that, and I'll report back on that and let you know. So, like, you, like I say, you guys have a wonderful day. Thanks so much for watching, and we will see you.